Hello, good evening. It's October 19, 2021, and it is, I think, past 8.30 in the evening. And I am here in the little, in the, in the sala of my little house in Fairview. And tonight, medyo magdidibiate ako sa usual kung seryosong mga vlog. And this time, medyo magpapatawa ako ng konti kung kayo'y matatawa. Kung hindi naman, okay lang. But uh, I try to be lighter tonight. Uh, my vlog tonight is uh, has something to do with the use of the Tagalog language or the Filipino language, no? And ito ay tungkol sa isang teacher at saka sa isang bata. So, okay, let's say, uh, let's start, no? Opening of classes. The teacher ay nandyan sa in front of the students and then sabi niya, class, let it be clear to everyone in this subject, I am not allowing the use of any other language except English. No Tagalog here. So yung, the, the student in front was looking at the teacher and he said, yes, mom. So the teacher smiled and he, and he said, okay, I think that is very clear. Now, young man, May I know your name? So, the young man stated his name. Sabi niya, my name mom is early seven, strike clan, never broke. What? Are you a film? Oh no, mom. I am a Filipino. I am a very, very much a Filipino. And why is your name like that? Because, mom, that is the English of my real name. And what is your real name? My real name is... <laughs> Agapito Kampaslupa Dimagiba. Agapito Kampaslupa Dimagiba. So, I translated it into English because you do not like us to speak in Tagalog. So, my, my name is very Tagalog. Agapito, Hampaslupa, ah, Dimagiba. So, in English, it means early seven, <laughs> strike clan, never broke. <laughs> so, the teacher was taken aback. And I don't know kung anong ginawa niya. Kasi ako, natawa ako nung mabasa ko yan, nung ma ma I came across that particular joke, no? And, habang <laughs> inaano ko, talagang natatawa ako. And this might also be <laughs> an awakening, no? It will serve as an awakening to many teachers na ayaw magpagamit ng Tagalog o ng Pilipino sa klase nila. At ang gusto nila ay laging English ng English. <laughs> eh, kung makatagpo nga tayo ng ganyang estudyante na pilosopo, no, may pagka, may pagka engengde sa ulo. May pagka sira din ng ulo. How are we going to, to ano, to uh, address the situation? Paano tayo mag, uh, uh, how are we going to react to the situation? Ako siguro, if I were the teacher, matatawa ako, ibis na ako ay magagalit. Kasi nakakatawa yung ginawa ng bata. For me, ha, for me. Now, uh, aside from this particular, uh, this uh, uh, konting nakakatawang bagay na ito, ito ay isa ring ano, eh, parang ano, naalala ko rin yung maraming mga teachers na sinasabi nila na walang gagamit ng Pilipino o Tagalog sa kanilang klase. Ang aking tanong ay bakit? Bakit hindi natin ipagamit yung ating wikang sarili? Mapera na lang and I can understand if the subject is English. But if the subject is not English, why do we prevent? Why should we prevent our students from using the language where they are comfortable with? Yung mad, na, mas komportable silang sabihin. At, uh, because the language where they were born into, the language they use in their houses, uh, they can explain themselves very well if they use the language where the, that they use in their houses or the language they are used to. Kasi 
we, we do not gauge. Kasi ang, ang, ang napansin ko kasi, there are those who look at uh, people who are not fluent, no? Lalo na kung hindi kagaya ko, hindi magandang mag-pronounce, oh, uh, in English, eh parang akala nila, less of an intelligent person yan. Less intelligent yung tao na yan. No! Because there are those who are very good in Filipino, who are very intelligent. Many people who are good in Filipino are intelligent and they excel in many aspects of life. And there are those who are very good in English. May patuang-tuang pa talaga akala mo ay galing sa Amerika, galing kung saan, ano western country. Pero hindi naman sila ganung katatalino. So hindi ma, hindi masusukat sa galing mag-ingles ang galing ng isang tao. That is my 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 ano, how I look at life. How I how, how I look at the use of language as ikang uh, not, not to be used as a gauge for the intelligence of a person. Uh, so uh, bakit ba ang, ang ibang mga lahi ginagamit nila ang kanilang wikang sarili? When you go to France, they speak in French. And you have to understand their language. You have to study their language if you are there because they will really speak in their language. Baala kong umintindi. Ah, ang, mga isp ang mga Japanese, ganun din. Ang mga Inchek. Ang mga Koreano. Ngayon na lang naman sila nag-aaral ng English eh. Pero, they are not uh, ashamed to speak in, the, in, in any conferences using their own language. Kahit na yung kanila mga leaders. Uh, they would uh, attend conferences and they will use their own language. And uh, bahala, merong interpreter. So, it's one way of making your language known. The language of your country known. And it is also one way of, uh, para sa akin yung, uh, making that language the language of the academe. Uh, the Filipino language should be the language of the academe. Kung po pwede lang sana na mangyari yun sa ating bansa. But until now kasi, Tayo ay may colonial mentality. Tayo ay may ang, ang standard natin ng galing ay ang yung, ang, ang, ang English. Nagiging standard natin ng galing yan. Kaya hindi na ang ating wika ay hindi umuusbong, hindi nagiging wika ng isang wika ng daigdig. If we can make it the language also one of the languages of the world, why not? Because Filipino is very beautiful. It's a very beautiful language. May indayog, ika nga. But my point here, here, here is, let us not prevent our students from speaking in Tagalog or in Filipino because that is our language. Yun lang naman ang take ko ngayon dito kay Agapito Hampas Lupa di Madiba. Translated in English, Agapito Early seven, hampas lupa, strike clan, timagiba, never broke. So, sa kala ni Agapito, hampas lupa, timagiba, magandang gabi sa lahat kong mga subscribers. Dumadami na, 420 na, sana madagdagan pa. Thank you, thank you very much. Good night, keep safe, God bless you all.